Hello guys, in this video we are going to see this NAND gate IC. It is 3 input NAND gate. Here all 3 inputs are 0, so we are getting 1 in the output. 0, 1, 0, output is 1. 0, 1, 1, output is 1. When all 3 inputs are high or 1, then only we will get 0 in the output. So this thing we are going to see in this video. So let's get started. Here it is IC7410. It has 14 pins. Pin number 7 is ground pin and pin number 14 it is VCC. We have to connect plus 5 volt. This IC has 3 NAND gate. Gate 1, gate 2 and gate 3. So this is the pin diagram. For the practical I will use only second gate and if you want to use other two then the connection will be same. Now we will see the practical circuit. Here is our IC. With the pin 14 we have to connect plus 5 volt and with the pin 7 we have to connect it to the ground. Pin 6 it is output and 3, 4, 5 are the input. With the output pin we are connecting an LED and with this we have to connect a series resistor. 3, 4, 5 are the input. With the input pin, we are connecting a switch and other pin of the switch is connected to the plus 5 volt. With the input pin, we are connecting pull down resistor. The value of the pull down resistor is 10 kilo ohms. And to see the input, we are connecting the LED with a series resistor of 220 ohms. So this is the practical circuit. As it is 3 input NAND gate, so we are naming it as A, it is B, it is C and we are naming the output as Y and we know the equation of NAND gate it is A dot B dot C whole bar equal to Y we will get the output as 0 only when all the three input will be 1 so we will verify this thing in practical 7410 I am putting it here, pin 7 is connected to the ground and pin 14 is connected to the plus VCC, switch A, B and C. One pin of the switch is connected to the plus 5 volt, pull down resistor is connected to the pin 3, 4, 5, connecting the input LEDs with the resistor. This is the output LED and here it is resistor. Switch A is connected to pin 3. Switch B is connected to pin 4 and switch C is connected to the pin 5 and with the output LED connecting the pin 6. Now connecting both the positive and negative rails. Connecting the 5 volt power supply. This is the negative and this is the positive. So as you can see all three inputs are zero so it is high. 0, 0, 001, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0. And when all three inputs are 1, then only we will get 0. So this is how this IC works. 3 input NAND get IC. So guys, this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any doubt on this, then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video, I'll show you another topic. Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.